micro skill number one, insertion of a laryngoscope using the modified scissor maneuver using a tongue depressor. The standard scissor maneuver is with the thumb and first finger or forefinger to open the mouth to place the blade. What I'm showing is a modified procedure in which a tongue depressor is used. I'll push the chin down on the momentum, place the tongue depressor as deep as I can. I'll use the middle finger instead of the forefinger against the teeth. I'm going to use my thumb and forefinger on the tongue depressor to push the tongue into the floor of the mouth, open the oral pharynx maximally to place the laryngoscope blade on the first attempt. I'm going to perform the laryngoscopy right over the top of the tongue depressor and take the tongue depressor out when it's no longer of any use. If I want to protect the teeth, I can actually even put the tongue depressor between the laryngoscope blade and the upper dentition. I'm going to expose the larynx now. If I place my thumb against the underside of the blade, I can actually uh, assist my lifting maneuver without uh, levering on the teeth. Another skill is to create room for tracheal tube delivery. I call this the salad poke because it came from the salad technique where I put my finger into the right corner of the mouth and in this case I can see the larynx under direct laryngoscopy just as easily as I can on video. I'm going to push the laryngoscope blade in just a little bit more to engage the hypoepiglottic li ligament. Another skill, micro skill, is the, is, the, is the pinch, I call this the salad pinch, where I grab the laryngoscope blade with my right hand and I use it to push the blade in deeper. In lieu of trying to do all the work with my left hand, I'm doing it with my right hand, push it in deeper. And now I've got perfect hypoepiglottic ligament engagement. I've got a great view on direct laryngoscopy. I'm going to put a little bit more force here. Yep, beautiful. Okay.